drunkenness, the rivalries, the hatred, the malice, and all these things. Amen. 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 Those are called the outward sins. Mm. Come on here. Come on. But what God is going to deal with, He want to deal with the inner yes. you. Come on now. He want to deal with those things, those thoughts behind what you do. Come on. The reason behind what you're doing. So when we talk about sin, I want you to know that it's all encompassing. It's, it's, right. uh, it's dealing with the works of the flesh. There are 17 works of the flesh. Amen. Amen. It's dealing with those 17 works of the flesh as well as what goes on in the inner man. Uh -huh. Amen. Amen. So when we look at this, he says, therefore, to him that know to do good and does not do it, it is sin. All right. Amen. Amen. So what is he saying here? He a lot of times. Um, as we've been talking about this, we've, talk, we've been talking about the ungodly beliefs, uh -huh. mm -hmm. how we entertain ungodly beliefs, how we entertain soul hurts, yeah. come on here, amen. how we're entertaining generational curses, mm -hmm. come on, amen. amen, sins that we ourselves have committed as well as the things that someone else said and did against you, yeah. okay. come on, amen. amen, so God says to us, Amen. When we're talking, about, we're also talking about the 17 works of the flesh. But he's saying to you, when he shows you that this is an ungodly belief. Come on. That you're dealing with ungodly beliefs. In other words, you're believing the lies and the false perception of the enemy. Amen. Amen. Once that thing is exposed and you don't judge it, as, as we said on last night, it becomes sin to you. Amen. Jesus. Wow. Amen. Y'all hear me? Amen. It becomes Amen. sin to you. That's Why? Right. Because God gave you the opportunity to deal with to it. Deal with Amen. He gave right. you the opportunity right. to judge That's it. That's right. Amen. Amen. And when we don't, it becomes, it, it ensnares us. Okay. So James says here, the word, and he gave me certain words and I picked them out. He says, no or knowing. That word means to see continually. Jesus. Amen. Amen. When we look at this in the King James Version, it says, knoweth. Amen. And I like to deal with the tense of the words, and it means to the point of continuation. So God says to us, he says, you that know to do good, that word means it's not just a one-time thing. Right. But what he said, it is a continuous thing. Come on here. Amen. Because you got to understand, we as apostolic people, uh -huh. come on here. We are under constant warfare. Amen. Amen. The warfare don't quit. It don't. Because you stop. Come, you better tell the truth. Amen. Y'all hear me? Amen. The warfare don't quit because... Yes.